Last to go in this group, another teenager from Korea. She's just 16 years of age. She was uh, 16 in October. She did go to Sochi, finished in 21st place there. Ninth in the four continents. Never been at Worlds before. What's her debut going to be like? She looks pretty relaxed, but appearances can be deceiving. So it's the swan for Park Su Yun. Perfect. Triple Salco, triple Tolu. Oh, not quite. Step out of that triple that's Another beautiful running edge off that double axle. Excellent. And that last shot of the crowd, and that one too, says so much. The Japanese here absolutely packed in like sardines. 18,000 of them. And their skaters don't appear for another two and a quarter hours. But they're here and making their presence felt, and they've been rewarded. Lovely skate there from Park Su Yun. Yeah, that really was super. I wouldn't be surprised if she goes into the lead with that performance. Shame she couldn't have hung on to that tri triple Lutz. But apart from that, there was a, an awful lot to admire in that program. I had all three spins at level four, which is the highest levels you can get. Good piece of footwork in there. Great combination at the beginning. A combination worth uh, nearly ten points. Nine and a half points and uh, likely to get... The thumbs up from the judges, so hopefully she'll get a good grade of execution for that as well. Do you see that uh, technical score already at 33 points? Here's that combination. Good speed out of the first part, the triple salco. Lovely triple toe on the end. Here's the Lutz, back outside edge, keeps everything nice and still. Left shoulder back nice and early. And just not quite sharp enough at the end. But the second mark shouldn't be too shabby either. No, the presentation was very, very good. Transitions in the program, good. Choreography was uh, very pleasing. 
Yeah, it really was a very, very good skate indeed. She really has it all. Good spins, great jumping technique, and uh, very elegant out there as well. Really good feel for the music. Always dangerous to use a piece of music like that, the swan that's been used so many times. We've uh, got to do it justice. And uh, she did just that. Absolutely fabulous. Well, I'm pretty sure we're going to be seeing her again on Saturday. And uh, at the end of this second group, we suspect that she's going to be the leader. Kim Yuna has got a lot to answer for, hasn't she? She's born so many great skaters who've just followed in her footsteps. And this is uh, just about the best of them, Park So Hyun. She should be the first skater to uh, actually qualify, shouldn't she, with that score? Certainly should. Into the lead she goes, 57-22. She knocks Gabrielle Dalman down into second place. So uh, she hasn't qualified yet, but it's very, very likely that she will. In fact, she will. Chris is right. She will qualify. And there's confirmation, because there's only five in the next group, three in the following group. So Park Soo-Yun, she makes it through. And no reason at all why uh, Dalaman and Ovcharova, Kim Hai-jin, possibly Jenna McCorker, we shall...